Hello dear students, in trick number 359, yet another trick on division. Yes, mental division can be very simple if you have little bit of understanding of the divisor. In this case, the divisor which I am taking is 8. Now, if you consider this 8 as a single digit 8, then there is a problem because the division will involve lot of steps. Long division method might prove time consuming here but when you consider this 8 as a product of 3 2's that is 2 into 2 into 2 then you should understand division by 8 as dividing by 2 3 times. And what is dividing by 2? Dividing by 2 is actually taking the half of the number. So when you take the half of the dividend three times, then actually you are dividing a number by eight. I'll just demonstrate this to you. See, 18 becomes nine when you take the half. So we have divided 18 by two. Nine becomes 4.5 when you divide it again by two. So 4.5 is the result when you divide this 18 by 4 and now one more time take the half 2.25 is the result when you divide 18 by 8 hope you have understood that because we are going to apply that technique to solve all these questions so take half three times you will get your answer on dividing a number by 8 so see 28 28 becomes 14, 14 becomes 7, 7 becomes 3.5. So 3.5 is the quotient when you divide 28 by 8. How much time does it take? I feel just 1 to 2 seconds only. And within that time, you will be writing just the dividend and the divisor by traditional method. So this method is for competitions. Simplification problems are normally based on such amazing shortcuts. 44 becomes 22, 22 becomes 11, 11 becomes 5.5, so 44 divided by 8 is 5.5. 92 becomes 46, 46 becomes 23, 23 becomes 11.5, so 11.5 is the quotient when you divide 92 by 8. 164 becomes 82, 82 becomes 41, 41 becomes 20.5 which is the quotient on dividing 164 by 8. More examples. Now decimal this time. 72 the half is 36. 0.8 becomes 0.4. Half of 36 is 18 and 0.4 becomes 0.2. Half of 18 is 9. 0.2 becomes 0.1. So 72.8 divided by 8 is 9.1. 112, the half is 56 and 0.4 becomes 0.2. Half of 56 is 28, 0.2 becomes 0.1. And now take the half, 14 and 0.1 becomes 0.05. So 14.05 is the quotient when you divide 112.4 by 8. More examples, see 512 is the first half, then the second half, 256 third half 128 so 1024 one, divided by 8 is 128 take half again 1324 take half again 6 6 2 6 6 and 2 take half again 3 3 and 1 this is the quotient when you divide 2648 by 8 and the final one, see this is 4000 and 108 becomes 54. So 4054. Then second half, 2027. And third half, 1000. This is 13.5. So see, 1013.5 is the quotient when you divide 8108 by 8. So see, students. These kind of calculations can be so simple if you have proper outlook and if you see divisors as product of primes. So 
If you like the videos, share them with your friends and do subscribe the channel.